Right then everyone, here at Longwood, let's just check we're in focus, because that would be a shame if we weren't. Right, we just climbed over the stile from a field, and look, look what greets us. Look at the white, like I promised, everywhere. Here, hardly a bluebell to be seen. One or two fading. So I've come back, I can't remember if it's a week or two weeks ago. I'll be able to tell by the dates, but um, this is what I said. This wasn't out like this when I came a week, to, week and a half ago. It could have been, it might have been a week ago even. Um, I think it's, it could have been, no, I think it's more like two weeks ago, nearly two weeks ago. And none of this was like this, but I knew it would be. So I've come back. This is an extra video to put on the end or to put at the beginning. And the smell of the garlic is absolutely, well, it's um, not obnoxious. It's intoxicating. It's powerful. There's so much of it, look. And they're really at their peak now. I knew they would be. I had to come back. So I have I deliberately planned my huge walk to include this at near the end. Look at these lovely furry, furry walls, look, as well. Everywhere you look, I can see the odd hint of blue, but everywhere you look now is white. The bluebells had their glory two weeks ago, and they're hanging on in just to add a bit of variety for the garlic. <laughs> I mean, even a week ago, they, they could have been in harmony together, but but the the, the white the white garlic flowers now of well, it's it's just unbelievable, really. It's unbelievable, isn't it? Look at that down there. Look. As far as the eye can see, is white. Absolute beauty. I'm just going to stop a minute and just take some photos and then I'll come back on again. I'm going to have to do that. Over and out a minute. Carrying on with the video. Just in case, sometimes I'm not even videoed, you know, I thought I have. So I'm just going over a bit just in case. I think it was definitely recorded a minute ago. Look at that beauty. Look at that beauty down there. Valley of white. You, you, you can't really describe it exactly because of the smell. The smell of it all. Look. Look at it. It's absolutely beautiful, this is. Absolutely beautiful. And all up the top there, none of this was out when I came here about a week and a half ago. It was in tight bud. It was, it was being, it was taking safety measures just in case there was a frost. I can only describe, people have to come here to feel this beauty. I mean, it's, you can't really describe it really, it's just total beauty. Oh, it's beautiful. And the trees and the green, all around, all around is beauty. I don't know if my sister Jude came here either. Don't know where she went. You have to get you have to get it right. Uh, it is about this time um, to capture.
to this, you've got to get it right. It does depend on what sort of winter we've had and what sort of weather. That does influence it as well. So it's not always the same date each time either. Not always identical. Because this time a year ago, I was in Leicestershire visiting the tomb of Richard III and walking around the Battle of Bosworth. I wasn't even here. So it's not the exact date, but it's very close. And I would have been very keen to get out here for this once I got back. I'm just going to turn off a minute, take some more photos. Right, we're leaving the little troll bridge now. Like I said, these little pink flowers that come out just highlight stuff even more, enhance everything. And look, far as it, and they're all out on this side as well. Absolutely beautiful. Well, what I'm going to do, I'm going to walk up. I'm going to walk up and round, do the top bit. And then if, if I f fill up to it, I might come just walk up the, through the valley a bit. But look at it. Absolutely brilliant. I can't actually say enough about it. Tell the truth. There's the stream. And just look at that. The butterflies and bees are having a feast. They're having a feast here. Look at it. Look over there. Look at that. Up at those trees all the way as far as you can see. is beauty. I'm having to do lots of snippets because I need to take photographs as well. What I do sometimes, I have two cameras. One for photos and one for video. I'm just going There's a few bluebells lingering up there. I just can't get over it. It's just absolutely, well, it's idyllic. Idyllic. Sound of water, beautiful day, sunshine, green leaves, beautiful smells. Like I said, I'm going to go up high, I'm going to climb up and do the top because um, I've already got quite a good indication from the bottom here, from this section alone. Um, obviously it's going to be just as powerful if I walk all the way up that way. I said I might come back and do a bit of the valley in a minute, but uh, I, I, I think I'll go up. I think I'll go up because that's where the bluebells could really be seen last week. Just waiting for the wild garlic to come out. This lasts for a short period of the year. And like I said, it'll be all the way along, all the way along there it will be. But we'll climb up. We'll climb up and observe as we go. Just going to turn off for a minute, just in case the battery goes. Stop that a minute.